Okay, so linear equations or constant rate of change questions is something where you're given a set amount and then the outcome depends on how many of some of the constant you do. So let's look at it. You're ordering an Uber. It costs a dollar fifty per mile and charges a five dollar pickup fee. So what we're looking at is that this result is going to be the constant, right? That dollar fifty a mile plus the five dollar pickup fee. So we know that no matter what, it's going to cost us five dollars. If that, no matter how far we go, we have to pay this five dollars. So we know that no matter what our answer is, we're going to add five dollars to it. So we're going to go ahead and add the plus five. Now it tells me it's one fifty per mile, and usually these questions will be worded as per mile, per minute. Um, they could be um, per months, per weeks. It's usually a, a time frame or a span of time, uh, distance. So it's one fifty per mile. So I know that for every mile, I'm going to have to pay a hundred. Uh, excuse me, a dollar fifty. So whatever this is, however many miles I go, it's going to be that times a dollar fifty because. Multiplication is repeated addition, and that's going to be my answer. And this makes sense if we use our vocabulary. Don't we know that X is independent and Y is dependent? Well, it doesn't matter how many miles I go. That's just going to be what X is. But doesn't Y depend on how many X's I put in here? Doesn't the outcome depend on how many I put in? So we know that that makes sense for that X to be there because it's independent. And we know that makes sense for Y to be there because it's dependent. Um, it makes sense to add these five dollars because it's going to be added no matter what, and then um, it's a dollar fifty per. So the last thing it could tell us is how many miles we went. So I'm going to say we're going to go um, six miles. So I'm going to say I'm going to go because remember this x is a variable that represents a value, and right now that value is my miles, so it's going to be times six miles. And then I'm going to again remember to add my five dollars because they picked me up. And that would be my equation.